with all right, all right, all right. This is BK Boy, playing seven days to die. Alpha 17.2, still. Today I want to show you uh, a mosh pit horde base design. And what I want to do is go through step by step on how you, you too can easily build this horde base. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to want to do is find a decent location. A, link, a location that's nice and flat and no buildings around that you have to get rid of. Because what we're going to be doing is we're going to be clearing out this entire area. We're going to get rid of all the plant fiber, rocks, plants. Just clean up the area really well. And of course, we're going to want to get rid of most of these trees that we see within at least 50, maybe even 60 block radius. 50 block radius should be fine. So we'll go ahead and get rid of these and continue. So as you can see, I got most of the trees and rocks, plants and stuff cleared out of the way. Step number two, building the foundation. You start by laying out a square, nine blocks by nine blocks. And we're gonna dig it down three blocks deep. Pick up the frame and dig down. Using the wood frames to show you, I made it a hole nine by nine and three deep. Step three, place flagstone base. You'll need to place 81 flagstone blocks. Step four, place sidewalls and pillars and upgrade. As you can see, I've already placed the walls and upgraded them to cobblestone. I also added those four inlets, I call them teeth, and upgraded them to cobblestone. And I added pillars, four high, in the middle and on each corner. And upgraded those to cobblestone as well. You can actually upgrade the entire thing to cobblestone on the upper part for the pillars and the, and the supports, but the supports in between there really don't need it. Step five, and you can top it off with iron bars or you can use wood frames, but I recommend iron bars. Here's a mosh pit that's been upgraded to reinforce concrete. And we also, uh, also added three blocks on the outside for like a base. And again, it's fully upgraded to concrete with the iron bars. This base is a beast. You can lose three of the pillars on the same side <clears throat> before you'd have any issues. We put a nice fancy lip on it to keep these spider zombies from being able to get up. Again, it's a perfect kill zone. Looking down. You can add on to and easily modify this mosh pit horde base as well. I want to show you an example of a slightly modified mosh pit horde base. As you can see, you still have the pit, the bars. I just kind of added a little bit of extra on the outside. A little bit. So there you have it folks, the mosh pit. I'd love to hear your comments down below of your experiences and what you think of the video. Also, make sure you leave a thumbs up if you like it. So until next time, I'll see you when I see you.